Hey everybody, Logan Allen Williamson here. Thank you for stopping by the channel. If you can't tell, I am down on the southeast side of Reno at the Summit Sierra Mall. I'm gonna give you a tour, stick around. All right, hey guys, Logan Williamson here representing Williamson Professional Real Estate Sales. It is a little blustery today, so for that reason, that well, you probably can't tell by looking at that little tree shimmy shaking in the back, but I'll tell you, a little bit windy, a little blustery, a little too blustery for my um, lapel mic here without a wind sock. So we're gonna go ahead and do the intro outro here in the vehicle, and then I'm gonna give you guys a driving tour of the Summit Sierra Mall. Now, if you're familiar with Reno at all, if you're considering relocating here, living up here, whatever, you may be looking at shopping, Maybe your spouse is looking up shopping. I'll tell you, the shopping options are not as robust as places like the Bay Area, some of these international cities, these port cities. It's quite limited up here, but we do have a couple spots that are significant and worth considering if you're looking at the shopping up here in Reno. Now, if you haven't seen my previous video about the Legends Mall, which I'll put the link in a card or something somewhere up in this video. If you haven't seen my previous video, maybe it'll be on the end screen. As far as what the Legends Mall looks like over near the Sparks Marina on the east side of town, the Legends Mall, I did a walking tour. There's Shields over there. There's the IMAX Theater, a couple really cool places, Nike Outlet, the Oakley Outlet. However, if you're looking at something a little different, the Summit Sierra Mall on the southeast side of town is in some people's opinion, the best mall in town. I think it really goes back and forth between Legends and the Summit Sierra Mall. I think they're both the two best malls in town. Yes, we do have Meadowood Mall, which is a little bit smaller and it's changed quite a bit from you know once upon a time. We used to have Park Lane Mall, which is now turned into um, what are apartment and condominiums. They still have the movie theater over there. But I will tell you, if you're looking for the best shopping in Reno, you're looking for either Legends or the Summit Sierra Mall. Now in this video, I'm gonna go ahead and give you a brief, driving tour of the Summit Sierra Mall. Now we do have Dillard's over here, which is one of the major attractions. We have Dillard's, we don't have a Nordstrom Rack, we do have a Nordstrom Rack up South Virginia, up the street here, but here the main attraction is gonna be Dillard's. We have some premium jewelry stores over here. We have a Lululemon. You know, you've obviously got your coffee shops. We have a movie theater over here, another Century Theater. You've got Zoomies, you've got, my gosh, you name it. Um, I'm gonna give you a tour, we'll find out. But I come over here for the running company um, to get a pair of running shoes. And primarily, like I said, the main attraction is going to be Dillard's. Now, as you know, this channel is dedicated to everything Reno, Sparks, Lake Tahoe, Carson City related, living, working, eating, sleeping, playing up here in the area. I'm a full-time real estate agent. If you have any questions about what the lifestyle is like up here in Reno, I would love to talk to you. My contact information is going to be in this video. Reach out, please. Smoke signal, carrier pigeon, preferably call, text, or email. But I respond to them all. Whatever gets to me will be responded to. So reach out if you have any questions. If you're looking at property up here, locating, relocating inside of Reno, relocating potentially to the Reno area, I'm here to help, never too soon to reach out. Um, but like I said, contact information is gonna be in this video. Please like the video, it helps us reach more people. Comment, subscribe, I'd love to have you frequent the channel. Um, but all that being said, let's get right into the driving tour of the Summit Sierra Mall on the southeast side of Reno. Sierra and you can see we are driving in here so there's quite a bit going on obviously trying to be safe driving here so over on the right side and we're coming right down the main pipe here so we've got the Century Movie Theater got a couple of places to get a bite to eat you've got Ike sandwiches where if you haven't been to Ike sandwiches they started in San Francisco they're absolutely fantastic that would be something to check out we've also got one on the north side of town up by the university. You got your pack sun. Ulta. Dojo Reno if you need a gi. Max Results, the Reno Running Company is what I talked about in the intro. Awesome running shop. Everybody's very knowledgeable in there. And I want to take you guys down into 
this actual area real quick here before we go over to the other side of the mall. Simply because some of these restaurants are fantastic. Okay, so you've got BJ's over here. And then coming up on this side. Okay, so you've got your Italian. You've got Schipolini's. Get a good Italian bite to eat in there. And one of my favorite restaurants in town, it's a little bit newer here, but it's called the Land Ocean. I believe it's the Land Ocean Grill. And it's right around the corner from Ike's. But I'm gonna drive right up to this place because I'm telling you, if you come into town and you like a good seafood bite to eat, this is gonna be the place to go. There's also an incredible a Japanese restaurant, ramen and sushi, that's right next door. So between the two of these here, between the Land Ocean, it's called the New American Grill, I would call it primarily seafood, right next to Miyabi, which is a Japanese restaurant. These are two places that are awesome to check out. So keep those on your radar, um, if at all possible. There's also this cool place over here called Escape Rooms. If you haven't checked out Escape Rooms, I went and did one in San Francisco. Uh, a little bit frustrating, a little bit more random than you would expect, um, but overall pretty good time. So now I'm gonna take you guys all the way out through the other end and I'm gonna show you basically the main side of the Summit Sierra Mall here. Give me just a second to get over there. Okay, now right at the entrance, if you're coming in on South Virginia, there's Miguel's Mexican restaurant, awesome has been in town for quite some time. I'd recommend checking out Miguel's if you have time. Okay, so coming into the main strip here. So you got the blue sports zone. You got Sephora here. You got Old Navy coming up on deck. Now you can see a lot of the shops that are over on this side, and I'm trying to give you the best angle possible. Coming up to Dillard's, but this is kind of the main strip. And then there's also, um, Well, there's two major sides, really. There's this side, and then there's the opposite side where I just took you over by BJ's Grill. But essentially, you got Dillard's. Coming over here, you got Patrick James. You've got a Pottery Barn, a very popular furniture store, as you know, home decor. If you're frequenting this channel, that might be a store that you actually want to check out. I'm going to take you right up by the Starbucks. Lululemon is gonna be up there with the big uh, you know, blue, green, turquoise, whatever you wanna call it, building up on the corner. I happen to be somewhat colorblind, so it's a bit challenging for me to tell. But if we pull right up to Dillard's right in front here, you can check that out. They used to have an Apple store over here, which I don't think they do anymore. They don't, I don't think. They think they might've taken it out. Okay, but right here on the left, as you can see, you're looking at Starbucks, you've got Yoga Pod, Devon Jewelers, there was a clothing store, I believe Hollister is right on the other side of this. You used to have an Abercrombie and Fitch that was over here. I think that's actually been removed. Oh, Hollister is gone too, now you got it. Okay. Okay, so on this side, like I said, right behind Lululemon, you've got Pottery Barn, you've got a Williams Sonoma, you've got a spa right to my left, Bed Bath & Beyond, White House Black Market for some cool clothes for all you ladies out there. You've got the <clears throat> Tangerine Aveda Spa coming up here right on the corner. And then I'll take you guys right up through here. Oh, there's the Apple Store. They just moved it. Okay, until I haven't been over here in a while. Yep, so you got the Apple Store right next to Pendleton, so that's cool. It's at the B's office, don't go there. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, and then coming up, this is kind of the last little bit here. You got Victoria's Secret, Bed Bath & Beyond, you got Loft coming up on a renowned um, healthcare clinic. You got Jared's Jewelers over here on the left. Once you get through basically this whole little area here, everything over to the left, there's that Century Movie Theater that you saw at the beginning, everything kind of behind us here. And once we head up and out to the right, this is a brand new apartment complex over here, <clears throat> Innova Luxury Apartments. 
studios all the way up to, I believe, four bedrooms. And once you head around the roundabout, then you're right at Mount Rose Highway here. We are gonna take a right going west, and then we're gonna get on 580 going north, and that's gonna take us right back up um, into the main area of Reno. Whew. Well, that was brief, but I hope it was helpful. Thank you for stopping by the channel. Logan Allen Williamson signing out. Again, I'm a full-time real estate agent. If you have any questions, contact information is going to be in this video and below. Make sure you reach out to me. If you have any questions, leave a comment below. I respond to all of them. Let me know what content you want to see next. I have a couple upcoming videos based on requests that people have made, but I want this channel to be informative and I want it to help you. Thank you for stopping by and I will talk to you here soon.